Well, hey folks, how you doing? Don Grant, CTC Cutting Tool Counselor for the Harvey Performance Company, here to give you a spring 2024 Harvey Tool new product overview. Harvey Tool comes out with two catalogs a year, one in the spring, one in the fall. Every time we come out with this new catalog, we have some great items in there. As you know, the Harvey Tool catalog keeps getting larger and larger and larger. Believe it or not, we have almost, almost, I say almost, topped 30,000 items in that catalog, all of which are on the shelf, stock, and ready to be shipped to your door when you need them. Well, of those 30,000, or almost 30,000, technically there's 29,000, there are some new items in spring this year that I'd like to go over with you and tell you a little bit about some of the PODs and how they work in your application. So thanks for joining me. Come along with me as we talk about the new 2024 Spring Harvey Tool Catalog. Well, hey folks, it's time, it's here. The new Harvey Tool Catalog is out this year, 2024 spring. I get to go over some of the new items that are in that catalog. As you know, that book keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger and larger and larger. And every one of those products that are in this catalog are there to serve a purpose and try and make your life just a little bit easier at your spindle. We're gonna go through those items. Uh, one at a time and we're going to tell you a little bit about some of the PODs and how they might be able to help you and why we added these to this 2024 spring catalog and Harvey tool. Okay folks, first tool up on the docket. I think it's time for this. It is time for Harvey tool to have a miniature tool, a miniature end mill with coolant through and that's what we did on this catalog. We added coolant through and one of our miniature series end mills. Okay, not cooling out the end, but this coolant comes out the transition area, gets your coolant right down to the tip of your tool, helps with chip evacuation, helps reduce the heat. Not a lot of heat on a measure tool, but trust me, lubricity and heat are two of the killers on this tool. So we've added a series of miniature tools with coolant that's coming out the transition area. Okay, so where did we offer this? Well, we offered it in our miniature sizes from 031 all the way up to 125 in diameter. It's not as large of an offering as you would think, but trust me, these are tools to serve a purpose and to solve a problem. That coolant through coming out that transition area is going to help you. It's gonna help sustain this tool when you're in kind of more of a roughing application. It's gonna evacuate those chips because trust me, on a miniature tool, you start recutting a chip you're gonna break that tool very quick. So this is offered again from 031 up to 125 in diameter, three times D, so that's three times D, okay? Which means take the diameter, multiply it times three. There's your length of cut. That's how deep you can go. So this is a nice feature and a nice addition to the Harvey tool catalog. And I'm kind of excited to put this into some situations where my customers need to evacuate those chips in a miniature situation. So check these out, miniature tools, cooling through, coming out the transition area, new in this catalog, offered in L10 coating. So you get that heat resistance. It's also offered in uncoated. So if you want to use these in aluminum and non-ferrous, you can, but you can also use them for some of your harder steels too as well because we offer it now tin coating. So this is a nice and the first new addition to this catalog 2024 is cooling throughout the transition area on miniature end mills from 031 to 125 in diameter. Check those out. So folks, you know what I always have problems with? Counterbores. Now why do I have problems with counterbores? Counter bores where you drill a hole and you want to counter bore that to put a socket cap head screw in or something that actually counter bores back so your screw is down in there. Well, I am sick and tired of chipping out the corners on those counter bores when I get into hard materials. What are we going to do about it? Hey, I got a great idea. How about if we put a radius on the corner of our counter bores? There you go. There's the next new item that we put in the catalog. That's my little segue to get there. It was a long way, but we got there. So that's where it at. Counter bores. When you're doing counter bores and harder materials, this is a counter bore with a true 180 bottom on it. Cylindrical margin on the side. Don't use it as an end mill. 
we have added corner radiuses to our counter bore series. Now we offer these in 062, so 1 16th in diameter, all the way up to half inch in a variety of sizes. Now we break that edge. So what does that do for you? Well, it's gonna help you from chipping that out because that edge is taking a great beating on there. So if you can get away with a little corner in there before you're dropping your set screw down in there or whatever you need to counter bore, we now offer counter bore tooling with corner radiuses on them. They're still offered square. If you need that clearance in the corner, we still have them square, but you know us at Harvey Tool, we like to add more items so if you want it square, you can get it. But if you want it with a corner radius, you don't have to mod it. You don't have to take your tools in the shop. You don't have to grind it on there. You can get them straight from Harvey Tool. You can get them with a corner radius on there. You can also get them square. That's another new item we just added in this catalog that you can use to help be more efficient at your spindle. Hey folks, do you know what an Acme thread is? We're not talking about the Roadrunner. Sorry, that was a little reference. We're talking about Acme threads. If you've ever done an Acme thread and you're watching this, Acme threads are not easy to make. They're very hard to get taps for them. They put a lot of pressure and uh, they're not very reliable when it comes to the cutting tools. We have come out with a single form Acme thread mill in this catalog. We already have an extensive offering of thread mills. Now we have Acme thread forms from quarter inch in diameter all the way up to one inch in diameter. Why is this a good thing? Well, if you understand Acme threads, you know that you can't have a lot of pressure because it's a blunt 29 degrees and it's square on the end. That puts a lot of force. So by using a single form, we can limit the force. We can limit the tool pressure. We can design these with a lot freer cut in geometry. And now you can use Acme uh, single form thread mills in the Harvey tool catalog to solve those problems when you're getting Acme threads. So, we now offer Acme threads in uncoated and encoded, so you can use them in non-ferrous. You can use them in ferrous. Look at the coated version. It's a C3, more of an Altin coating for your heat resistant. Add some lubricity, and we have stock Acme threads added to the 2024 spring catalog in the Harvey tool. Check them out. So folks, the last thing I want to mention that's a real good highlight in this catalog, the 2024 spring catalog for Harvey tool, is metric reamers. We found a gap in our reamer, so we wanted to add, starting at 0.457 metric in diameter all the way up to 8 millimeter on metric shanks. 3 millimeter shanks, 4 millimeter, and 6 millimeter shanks. As the tools go up in diameter, the shank gets larger. But now we have metric tools, metric reamers on metric shanks, straight flute. Fills a lot of gaps. If you look at the inch one and you can't find exactly what size reamer you're looking for, take a look at the metric. It's gonna help you fill some of the gaps that are in the inch. Let's talk about the tolerances on the reamers. Now we offer these in uncoated for a lot of your non-ferrous materials. And we also offer them in coated with an Altin coating. We call it C3, but it's an Altin coating for your steels. What you're gonna find with those tolerances on the reamers is there's a two tenths tolerance on all our reamers. Uncoated are minus two tenths, coated are plus two tenths. It's a plus tolerance when you go to the coating. So great tolerances on these reamers, now offered in metric, still find the inch. We don't ever take anything out of the catalog, we just add things. This catalog is getting larger and larger and larger. So now we have metric reamers from 0.457 in diameter. If you want to know what size that is an inch, divide it by 25.4 and you'll figure that out. All the way up to 8 millimeter in diameter with a variety of sizes in between. So you can find those in between sizes on metric shanks. Great add, great addition for this catalog and we're making it even better so you get the tools that you need when you need them. So that's it. That's all the new tools I wanted to talk about, but I wanted to do some highlights at the end of this and tell you how you can find out where the other tools are that we added. Those are new product lines. That's what we really want to highlight here are the new product lines. But with those new product lines, one thing that Harvey Tool does and all of our brands do is we like to expand on the products that are in the catalog and we like to fill some of the gaps. If you're wondering where in the catalog that we filled those gaps, here's what I want you to do. If you have a favorite page or if you have a favorite tool that's in the catalog, 
open that page up. If you see any EDP that's on that page that is written in red, that is red, that means it wasn't in the last catalog, which means it wasn't in fall 2023. It is new to this catalog. It's an easy way to find out what we expanded, what we added from the last one, and that could be a different length of cut. It could be a series on radiuses. It could be an added diameter or an added reach. So if you look in the catalog and you're just kind of scrolling through it, like we all do, it's kind of like a, a good magazine to read on an airplane or uh, when you're in the car or when you're on a long trip. When you're looking through it, if you find any EDP in there that is in red, that mean it, is, it means it is new from the last catalog. Just wanted to point that out. It's going to be a good way for you to find out what was new from the uh, last year, 2023. Now, when the new catalog comes out, all those items are going to turn black EDPs and you'll see new ones in red. That's how you identify which items are new and weren't in the catalog from years prior. So folks, this has been great, but there's one more thing I just want to add and mention. We have something called Machining Advisor Pro. I talk about it a lot. It's called MAP. You can download it. You can download it from any one of our brands on our web pages. Uh, notoriously, it's been known for one of our brands called Helical. Has all the EDPs in there. Just last year, we have added all of our Harvey tool part numbers into this software. So whether you're using a lollipop, whether you're using a thread mill, whether you're using a drill, whether you're using a reamer, you can go into this software. You can put your EDP right over here. Right away, it's going to recognize that EDP. It's going to know what it is. It's going to give you options for material. You put your material in there. I think there's almost over 400 material grades in here. You put your material in there, fill out a little bit of more information so it knows your setup. It's gonna tell you what all your parameters are, whether it be thread milling, it's gonna tell you your circle, your surface foot, your inch per tooth, and it's gonna give you all those parameters. If you haven't downloaded it, or you think it's only for helical, it is for Harvey Tool, and you can get those items in there, and you can use it to get up and running at the spindle quicker than ever. So please, if you get a chance, download the Machining Advisor Pro, try it out, use it with a Harvey tool, use it with those EDPs. If you have any questions or trouble, just give us a call. We have a great tech department. We'll help run through it and we'll get you up and running. But that is a great resource. Another great resource for you to use for Harvey tool product at your spindle. Well, hey folks, Thanks for joining me, Don Grant, CTC Cutting Tool Counselor on this edition of Harvey Tool Spring 2024 Catalog. I love doing these and talking about the new product. If you have any questions or you need any more help with that, please call our amazing tech line, try one of the resources, and we'll be able to get you up and running or help explain these tools even better. This has been a quick overview. I can't wait to talk about fall 2024 items in the Harvey tool catalog. I don't know if you knew that, but Harvey comes out with two catalogs a year. So we get to add even more items in fall of 2024. I will be doing a release on that and I can't wait because we got some really good tools coming out in fall 2024 too. That's even going to make that catalog even better. Thanks for joining me. I appreciate it. Hope you enjoy using Harvey tools. Hope you enjoy using these products and hope you enjoy watching these videos. But until next time, please take care, enjoy your week and let us know if you have any questions with Harvey tools.